we're out here at this Chrysler 300 and I'm already seeing bad stuff because if you look right there, he's already missing a lug nut. And that one was pretty loose. This is what I'm here for. See the sway bar link? And then, if we go around on the other side and take a look. Oh, do you see that CV axle in there? That's not good. So I'm gonna get that sway bar link off and I'm gonna talk to the customer about doing the CV axle on this side and maybe some brake rotors. So you, there you see we got the new sway bar link in. Time to put the wheel back on on this side and then we're gonna move to the other side. I talked to the customer and I told him that he was throwing grease all over out of the other the other CV axle and he said go ahead and replace it. Hey, good news, at least there's all five lug nuts on this side. <laughs> it's gonna break yeah it's not good news whoever put this side on put them on too tight and this one's cross threaded I think Something you may think you know, but if you're not a mechanic, you don't know, is that a hammer is not only your friend, it's one of the most important tools in my toolbox. I use, I use a hammer every single day, almost every single job. So I started by getting the wheel off, and then I took the axle nut off, and now I'm taking the brake caliper off. my pads off and then we got to get this bracket off all right I think the easiest way to do this is going to be to take the top off so that's what we're going to start with got it loose I left the nut on it and then I tapped it with a hammer All right, so I got it all back together. I'm gonna put this wheel back on and we're gonna give a customer a call. And then we're gonna go and work on Victor's RV. Probably go take some lunch. 
because that's going to take all night. So I'm out here at the RV and I'm going to start taking apart the ready arm bushing. We got the radius arm bushing done on both sides. We got the whole front end rebuilt. We did the rear brakes, but uh, the customer said that the rear brakes are, uh, they seized up on them coming back from Payson. And these big RVs uh, built on the Fords, Ford chassis, they're, they're notorious for rear brake seizing up. So we're gonna take them, take them apart again and just check everything out. Today was a full day, keep an eye up the hill.